besides the obvious reasons, dental floss can be used for many things in your survival bag. From suturing up wounds, to sewing, to trip wires, lashing, you can even make rope. But today, we're gonna make fishing string. dentist from New Orleans, Louisiana, named Levi Spear Parmley, invented dental floss in 1819. It wasn't until 1882 that dental floss became commercially available. Johnson & Johnson received the first patent in 1898, and it wasn't until the 1970s that floss became part of the North American daily personal care routine. Remember this guy? Today we're gonna use it with our alternate fishing line, see if we can catch some fish. This particular brand of dental floss has 140 yards. It's the Rexall Mint Wax Dental Floss. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spool up enough for this hobo handrail. hook, line, and sinker. <laughs> Got the hobo handrail with a cork and a cricket. Let's give it a shot. There you go, dental floss on a hobo handrail. Nice size little perch. Now we're gonna string up this modern fishing pole. It's a regular bait caster. And we're gonna see how this performs. on a modern pole. Let's see how it casts. Harvest a little fish with dental floss and string for the fishing pole. Not the biggest in the world, but he will eat. Hey, thanks for watching this episode of Spear Outdoors. If you like it, please give me a thumbs up. Please leave a comment. Please subscribe, share this video, and thank you to all my supporters, and I'll see you next time.